There are a number of ways to create checks within Dynamics GP. The one I like the best uses this window right here, Edit Check Batch. Go to your Purchasing Area page, hit Edit Check Batch. It brings up this screen here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to select which invoices I want to include in this check batch. So the first thing I need to do is identify a, a batch ID. And I'll just use my name here. I do want to add this batch, so I hit Add. I'll specify what the checkbook ID should be. And this is the checkbook from which these checks are going to be written. So I'll save that batch ID. When I tab off that, it's going to show me all my vendors. So let's just select a vendor here. And I've got a number of invoices that I owe this particular vendor. And I don't want to pay some of these, so I'm going to take those off here. And then uh, let's go look at another vendor down here. Let's take a look at this one. And maybe I want to pay this, but I don't want to pay the whole amount. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into this edit checks here and I'm looking at this particular payment and I'm looking at the apply amount and you know I don't want to pay all this invoice so what I can do is just say well I'm going to pay $500 of this and when I make that adjustment it's going to keep the remaining on the account but you just use the $500 in this particular check run so I hit OK on that and I'll save that payment now I've got two payments in my batch and I'm ready to print those checks so once I'm ready, I'll just hit Print Checks. It's going to go through and print the checks. And I've got a number of different formats. The one I like the best is probably this one here. So I'm just going to print this. And I'm going to print it right to the screen. And this is an option. This is, shows you what the check will look like when it prints out on paper. You can see that in a regular check stock. And then after it's printing the checks, it comes up with this option. I can post these checks or I can reprint them, I can void them, or I can just process later. So what I'm going to do is I'm ready to go. i post these checks. I've looked at them. They're fine. So I'm just going to hit process. If I didn't want to make that decision right at this time, I could always go process later. But I'm just going to hit process. This is going to post the checks and update the journal ledger.